Welcome back to the Burton U.S. Open. We're here live at Golden Peak this morning. And you know, Burton has been doing the U.S. Open for 35 years. It's one of the longest standing companies in the snow sports industry. And they also are very dedicated to continuing the efforts of having snow by being really sustainable. And with me this morning, Ali, you have a huge role in the sustainability of Burton. Tell us about what you do. Um, I actually run our sustainability program globally so we have a whole team of people um, just trying to improve our impact on the environment and people really nice okay so some of the things that are going on here at the u.s open like what are what are the, some of the ways that people can actually help kind of contribute to keeping the u.s open sustainable so we have two main focus areas for this event uh specifically so one is we're trying to get to zero waste so we have composting recycling all throughout the venue um, and we've been doing that for a few years now and then our big new effort is uh, making the US Open carbon neutral. Okay so what exactly does that mean? So that means that we count every single gallon of fuel used for example and every every ounce of electricity used for the event so everything from putting on the concerts in Solaris to VIP tents, um, all the screens, and then the fuels used, you know, for snowmaking, moving snow. So we calculate all of that, um, and then we offset it. So we purchase offsets, which means renewable energy and reforestation projects, so that the event in general is a positive impact on the environment. Oh, look at that. So I mean, you know that, you know, a lot goes into the setup. We've been watching, you know, the snow cats going up and down all morning. And then, you know, the crew is just out here kind of setting up the fences. And we know that there's a huge undertaking to actually create this event, create this kind of festival feel for everybody. So the fact that now we can kind of feel that much better about it, that's pretty amazing. Yeah, we should. And, you know, we're trying to do everything we can with all of our products. So we're using sustainable materials throughout our whole product line, uh, manufacturing sustainably too. So this is just the next step. If we're going to put on an event, you know, we should do it the right way. And snow is important to all of us, so we got to make sure that we have snow and we do it by things like carbon neutral events. Wow, that's amazing. Now, you know, there's there's a lot going on. We actually had a chance to do the Burton Girls Ride Day yesterday. <laughs> there's another one that's going to be going on today. But for people that want to come out here and, you know, not only help contribute to sustainability, but also to enjoy the event, what would you recommend as far as, you know, planning out the day, making sure that they're not missing anything? Um, I would definitely catch all the finals, um, and you can go on, we have an app, so BurtonUSOpen.com, there's an app that tells you everything that's going on. Um, I personally like to sneak in some riding in the sunshine, um, like we did yesterday with the Burton Girls, um, and then yeah, if you can't get up to the event area, you can just see everything on the big screen. Nice. Okay. So again, you know, regardless, come on out here, check out the event in person. Also, BurtonUSOpen.com for more information or download that app. And of course, Ali, thank you so much for all of, all of your hard work and helping to keep this event sustainable and also Burton and all the work you guys do. It's such a pleasure. All right. Coming up, we have Watch and Win, so don't go away.